This is the story of Becky and Paul. After 16 years, they've been through it all. It started out a Saturday night crush. Becky thought fit, fit Ab guy was rather lush. After a couple of weeks partying in the same bar, they got talking but who knew that one kiss would bring them this far. Luck comes in many forms, from winning the lottery to finding a fiver in your pocket. Now, I've never won the lottery, but I stand here the luckiest man alive. Somehow, I've managed to find someone to share my life with who is even more beautiful on the inside than she is on the outside, which, when you consider how utterly stunning you are, is pretty incredible. I love you because you always support me and push me to achieve the best. You never allow me to quit even when I want to, and because of this you bring out the best in me. Paul, I love you because you accept me for who I am. You understand my need for pillows, you learn to accept my loud voice, and you've accepted my need for Caroline. Paul, I love you because even though you drive me crazy like no one else can, you can also make me laugh like no one else can. A vow is about making a promise. So the promise I want to make you today is this. You have spent 16 years making me a better person than I ever thought I could be. So I will spend the rest of my life making sure that I love you, honour you and try to make you as proud of me as I already am of you. So I am honoured and delighted to now pronounce that you are husband and wife. Congratulations, you may kiss your wife. Together, you make a team that is a force, that is not afraid to confront your fears and build an even better tomorrow. I think I speak for all of us here today when I say that wherever we joined you on your journey, we have enjoyed witnessing your love grow and deepen, and we are so excited to see where next that journey takes you. Everything that is good about me comes from her. Like, every single bit of it so she makes she makes me a better person like I, I like I don't even know what I'd be at the moment so if if you could all please stand and raise your glasses for me please I'd like to make a toast to Rebecca Rebecca